day 11. Bit of a mixed energy day today. Went for a morning walk, as I have every morning so far. Um, and later in the morning, actually went for that second bike ride. It was pretty hard, um, but recovery was a little quicker, so happy with that. Nearly finished my current book, so progress is good there. Headed out for my second supermarket trip today. This one was to pack and save in Botany. Not a bad experience. Brief videos follow this. The COVID cases were on the rise again, uh, from 950 up to 1,039, 89 new. One thing that hasn't been discussed, as far as I'm aware, in the revelation of these figures is the timeline for testing and results. The current situation is that when tested, you receive your results in four or five days. Now, based on the criticality of this information, the government probably receives it before the patient. However, I wouldn't think there would be more than 24 hours in the time gap. So if you don't get where I'm going with this, it's likely that the results that we're currently hearing are the test results of around three days ago, not the test from the swabs taken in the last 24 hours. If I'm wrong on that, please, someone let me know, I'll link to a source or whatever in the comments below. Additional activities today, I introduced my mother to video calling, with some success. So she had a round of local video calls, and we'll be trying to reach out overseas in the coming days. We wrapped up our family evening with uh, our nice activity of circling around and around in the local car park with our bikes, scooters and legs, and ended in the dark, came home to cook dinner. Daylight savings are a bit brutal in the evenings. Um, that was pretty much a wrap, so happy day 11 everybody. Tomorrow's Monday, let's see how we go. Alright, so this is my second supermarket trip during this isolation period. Um, this time I'm at uh, Pack and Save in Botany. Unfortunately, I just realised on the way here I forgot to shave, which is part of the criteria really of bothering to wear a mask, but I'm still going to chuck one on anyway. I'm not going to head home and have a shave and do all that. Um, I'm here, so give it a go. Um, I'm just going to show you the car park here. It's not that busy, which is quite cool. Bear with me. Just a bit of a look out the dirty car windows. Car park is only a little bit busy towards the front of the store there. Back into the car park looking pretty empty, which is a good sign. So hopefully I'm not going to be waiting around for too long. All good. So it took me about 30 minutes to get a load of groceries. Um, the scenario in there is pretty orderly. Uh, there really weren't that many people in there, it was all good. Uh, they are letting people in, spacing you out, all that sort of drama. Although, when you get in there, uh, yeah, people are a little bit dim in relation to spacing. Some of them are careful, some of them just aren't really thinking about it, aren't being considerate. Um, so you do have to kind of take into account other people's lack of brain power, I guess. Um, but yeah, overall, relatively uneventful. Forgot one item, but I'm not going back for that. Alright, gotta go.